and welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is going to be what's on my pandora bracelet this was actually the first ever video on my channel and since then i collect a few more charms and the first video was really cringe and the quality was not really good because i filmed with my phone and now i have my canon g7x so i thought let's make a new video about my pandora bracelet my team on my bracelet is like pink and girly and i'm excited to show you all of my charms but first if you're new here on my channel i'm a dutch girl and i'm living in marmaris turkey and i make a lot of beauty related videos lifestyle vlogs if you like that make sure you subscribe i upload twice a week every wednesday and saturday and of course you can also follow me on instagram and now let's get started with the video so first of all let's talk about the bracelet itself this is the pandora moments bracelet with a hard clasp it is a snake bracelet so it's flexible which i like because you can fill your bracelet up and i think with the bangle it's a little bit harder you can't make that one full so yes i'm really happy with this bracelet i believe this size is 19 centimeters but I'm not really sure about that. But yes, it's a really good size for me. Then let's talk about the first charm that I have on here. And this is a really cute fairy. This fairy I have for a really long time. I think maybe over 10 years. It was one of the first uh, charms that I got. I think it is really beautiful. I love fairy tales and fairies. So yes, I think this is such a beautiful and feminine charm. I think you can't get it anymore. Um, I'm almost sure it's discontinued because it's a little bit older. But yes, a really cute charm. I have quite a lot of hearts um, on my bracelet. And this is a little heart that says, granddaughter and I got this charm from my grandmom obviously and uh, I got this I believe two years ago for my birthday and what I really like about it is the handwriting like it's really delicate and beautiful and I also really love the little pink heart I think it's really nice that Pandora sells like these mom, grandma, uh, daughter, sister uh, charms I think it's really meaningful and if you want to give a present to someone like for example to your sister I think it's just really nice and you instantly uh, know from who you got it so i really like that pandora uh, does that the next charm is a clip and this is a beautiful flower daisy this one i got um, also a few years ago in amsterdam and what i love about it is all the little stones it is really shimmery and shiny especially if the sun hits the little stones you can really see the reflection and it's just absolutely gorgeous i think it's a really beautiful and delicate uh, clip I would really recommend putting clips on your bracelet because uh, then your charms are not moving all over the place. I really think a clip is uh, necessary for a bracelet. And why not purchase a nice and fun clip? Then the next charm is a glass one and I've got three of those on my bracelet but uh, all three are a little bit different, all pink. But this one is with all little glitters. And I think it's so, so beautiful. Again, when the sun hits it, you can see all the little glitters, reflections. It's just beautiful. And I think glass ones add a really nice uh, color to your bracelet. Because if it's all silver, it's just silver, you know? So if you want a theme like blue, green, pink, um, yes, you can definitely add that really easily with that uh, glass uh, charms. And they stay also really nice. You don't need to clean them often. So that's also a plus. Then this really beautiful white with silver one. And I've got two of those uh, with daisies. These are spacers. They are a little bit smaller than the other charms. And spacers you can put uh, between your bigger charms. Fill them up a bit and i just love these again really girly and feminine i believe they are also not too expensive they are a bit cheaper as well i believe these were like 25 euros so they are definitely not that expensive as some of the other ones and yeah i just really like them and white you can add in a lot of different bracelets um it goes with a lot 
So I think they are super cute. And then in the middle of those daisies, I've got uh, one of my favorite charms, I guess. And it's my Disneyland Paris uh, charm. And this is just beautiful. And it's quite expensive, I'm not gonna lie. It is like 17 euros, 70, not 17, 70 euros. So it's quite expensive, but it's just beautiful. You can only get this in Disneyland Paris, nowhere else. And I believe all of the Disney parks have a different color. Also, uh, which is really nice so if you visit one park I would definitely recommend purchasing this one because it's just so special and I just really like that idea that you can only get it there so then you have a really nice memory of Disneyland and yes if you follow my channel or my Instagram you know I'm obsessed with Disney so yeah it's definitely one of my favorite uh, charms and I got this one in 2019 so two years ago in October, it was Halloween uh, in Disneyland. If you like to see the vlogs, I will link them somewhere up here. But yes, it was such a nice uh, holiday uh, with my family. So yeah, a really nice memory. Then again, another gloss one. And like I said, they're all a little bit different. And this one got all little hearts in it, which is so pretty. So it's glass, but it has also little glass ones. I will put all little close-ups as well in the video. Then you can see it a little bit better. But yes, it's just really special and beautiful. And maybe this is my favorite gloss one. I'm not really sure, but it's just gorgeous. Then another Disney charm that I think is so cute, and that's of course Minnie. This was the first charm I got when they start selling the Disneyland, um, the, not the Disneyland, the Disney charms here in uh, Europe. Uh, that's not a very long time ago, since a few years, I believe. Um, and yes, this was the first one I got. I just love her little bow. And I think your bracelet is just more fun with Disney on it. So a really cute little Disney charm. The next charm I have on here is another clip. And this is also one of the first ones I got. So this is silver, but the little ball uh, on it is gold. And I also believe this one is discontinued. I believe you have this one without the gold. Um, I believe that one they still sell. I'm not really sure, but I will check it and then I will put a link down below. But um, yes, a really beautiful clip again. I have to say I do prefer the glittery one, but yes, it's just a nice clip. And like I said, you need it so they don't move all over the place. Then the next charm is another heart and there's quite a lot of hearts or like little hearts uh, team on my bracelet. And this one says a love in all different languages. And I think that's so beautiful. So it says amour, love, amor. Um, then on the other side it says Liebe in Germany, Amore. And this one is, I believe, Scandinavian language. I'm not really sure. Klarigheid. I'm not sure. I believe it's like Swedish. I don't know, Norwegian maybe. But yes, it's a really cute, just silver heart. And I think this is really a nice present to give someone. And then the next charm, I really, really love this one. I got from my father and it has all little pink hearts with a few golden hearts on it. And it's just so delicate and gorgeous. And I just love this charm. I don't know. It's just really adorable with the golden hearts. It just makes it really special. So a really beautiful charm. I think this one is also discontinued, but again, I will look everything up and if I can find them, I will put a link down below for you guys. Then my last uh, gloss one, and this is just a plain pink one, also really beautiful, but this shape is a bit different and you can see it really well in the close-up and I think that makes it really nice. It's a little bit warmer pink than the other two. But I think they go all really nicely together. And then my last charm is this present with a really cute bow on it. And I can remember this charm really well when I got it. Because this was uh, when I got my driver license. So yes, I was really happy with it. And it was also one of my first charms. So again, a super special memory about this one. And then the last thing that I have on my bracelet is this safety chain. And this is really good to have because it will protect your bracelet. It will protect your charms from falling off. And this one is a really adorable one with again, all little hearts. So definitely a little bit of a heart theme going on. You just put it on your bracelet first. And then you can put the other one on the ends. Wait a minute. Yeah, like this. You can just put it on. 
and then as you can see if your bracelet opens it will protect your charms from falling off and i think you really need this because it will be such a shame if you lose one of your charms so yeah i think this is again really cute and it fits really perfectly with the bracelet then the last thing i have from pandora is a ring and it's this beautiful princess ring that i really love i think it goes again really well with the bracelet if i wear them together and i just love that ring so much So this is everything that I have on my bracelet. I don't know if I mentioned it already, but it's the Moments uh, bracelet. So basically all of the Moments charms uh, fit on this. So I think it's a really nice idea to give to someone. If you are still looking for a little Valentine's present, uh, you can definitely give something from Pandora. It's always nice to receive. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give the huge thumbs up because you really help my channel with it. And don't forget to subscribe i upload twice a week every wednesday and saturday and of course you can also follow me on instagram and i hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos bye